those questions okay and actually i joined late so i don't know about the full level percentage chapter uh divesh right yes ma'am okay divesh don't worry i will take your extra class okay but i will let you explain okay ma'am yeah children may we start yes ma'am yes ma'am okay so okay so if 15% of workers if 15% of workers in a factory are females okay and the number of male workers number of male workers are Two hundred seventy-two. Then find the total number of workers. So, children, will you try this question? Yes, ma'am. Okay, please try it. Ma'am, can you repeat the question again? I couldn't understand your handwriting. See, fifteen percent of workers in a factory. are females okay? okay and the number of male workers male workers strength is given 272 then you need to find the total number of workers so we have to find total workers, number yes how many workers are there in all okay okay yes start doing yeah i'll copy the question Ma'am, can we use a variable to uh, to uh, to depict the total number of workers? Yes, you can use. Okay, ma'am. I'm gonna send the answer in the chat. मारू दे सिद्धांत Mama, I uh, I send the answer in the chat. Ah, uh, yes, correct answer. Sidan, can you show me your notebook, Peter? Ah, uh, yes, ma'am, just a minute. Yes, because I want to see your steps. Rohini, are you able to solve the question, beta? Um, yes, ma'am. I'm trying to do. Okay, Hamza, Shritej, Rishit. Yes, ma'am. I'm doing. Okay, Manas. Okay, yes, ma'am. Doing, ma'am. Charvik. 
अद्रेस अद्विका ऐश्वर्या आर यू समवेयर आउट आउट साइड समवेयर आई एम कमिंग फ्रॉम माय क्लास मैम ओके बिकॉज़ आई गेस यू आर सिटिंग इन अ कार राइट यस मैम मैम जस्ट मैम दिस लाइक एडिटिंग दिस लाइक द वेबकैम आ विल यू शो मी बेटा या मैम आई शो या शो देन Just keep closer to the screen. Just to make it. Siddhant, you have not given any statement, beta. Man, uh, the upper part of the statement. Yes. It is quite necessary to write each and everything, beta, while solving the question. Yeah. Okay. Okay. But remember, the process is right, right? Yes, it is correct. Ma'am, okay, ma'am. From next question, I'll add the statement. Yes, that's why I was asking you to show the notebook. Okay. Because if you will not write statement in your exams, okay, then your marks will be rejected, beta. Okay. So children, all have done, or may I explain it? Just tell me. Oh, uh, ma'am, can you give two more minutes? Yes. Shri Tej, are you there? Yes, ma'am. Ma'am, can you explain? Yes, I am going to explain. Just wait. Ma'am, can you please explain? I am not getting the answer. Okay, Ashwath. Okay, okay. See, children, what you have given a fifteen percent. of the worker in factory factory yard females so it means what you have given there are two methods to solve it so first of all we have to find the total number of worker right so you will write you will suppose let the total number of workers be x okay okay ma'am okay beta so Now percentage of female are percentage of female is fifteen. Fifteen percent. Fifteen. Ma'am, fifteen okay. out of hundred because total is hundred every time. Yes, yes. Just wait, wait, wait. Now percentage of female is fifteen percent. Then what about percentage of male? Bit, bit, uh, beta. So seventy-two by ninety-five percent. So it will be. Hundred minus it will be hundred minus fifteen, right, beta? Yes, ma'am. Eighty-five percent. I'll send you my answer. Okay, but I'm checking. So it will be eighty-five percent. Now you have given number of male workers. So number of male worker are two hundred seventy-two. Right. It means Eighty-five percent of total workers is two hundred seventy-two, right, beta? Yes. So now you can write eighty-five percent as eighty-five by hundred. Of means multiply total workers are x is equal to two hundred seventy. Is it clear, children? Yes. Yes. Now sir. you will write eighty five x by hundred is equal to two hundred seventy two. Okay. Now you will yes yes you will take you will shift the hundred to right hand side so it will be eighty five x is equal to yes, beta. I have a doubt. I have a two con. Where? Um. Uh, eighty-five by hundred into two. Uh, how did you? No, no, it is into x, beta. This is oh, x. Okay. 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 So two hundred seventy-two into hundred divided by eighty-five. So now here in hundred and eighty-five, 
their unit place digit is 5 and 0. So, therefore, they are divisible by 5. five, five. five. So, 5 and 5. 517. 17, 5 is 85. Then 20. Right, beta? Yes. Now, which table it will go? 17, 1 is 17. Then 17, 6 is 102. So, 16, 2 is 332. So, yes. So, total number of workers are 320. Understood, children? Have you any doubt in this? Ma'am, I got the correct oh, answer. Okay, beta. Very good. Mama, ma that's what... Uh, thank you, ma'am. Clean from uh, 85 by 100 into X is equal to 272. From there, can you explain again? Yes, yes. I'm going to explain. Just wait. See, beta. 85 by 100. See, it was 85 by 100 into X is equal to 272. Right, beta? Yes, ma'am. So, you will multiply 85 by X. It will be 85X. Yes, Divided by 100 is equal to 272. Now, in left-hand side, 100 is in division. So, when you are shifting it to right-hand side, it will go in multiplication. So, 85x is equal to 272 into 100. Clear, beta? Yes, ma'am. So, value of x will be 272 into 100. Now, 85 and x both are in multiplication. So, when you are shifting it to right-hand side, it will go in denominator. Okay, beta? Okay, ma'am. Now cancel them. You will get 320. Understood? Yes, ma'am. Okay. So, children, kindly note it down it. I'm having corrected our maths papers of subject to test. Yes, I have already posed the... I have already... Do the evaluation, beta. Even I have posted the marks in your ISAP. Okay, ma'am. I did not check that. Okay. Even on Monday only I have checked. Ma'am, okay. did you simplify? Uh, it was 272 into 100 by 85, right? By yes, beta. How did you simplify? Scroll it? down a little bit. First of all, you will divide 272 by 7 uh, by 17. Okay, okay. Then you will get 16. Okay, beta? Okay. Now, ma'am, for the Sunday subjective test, like, uh, my father was not in my home, so, like, I could not, uh, I could not submit the test in the WhatsApp, so I sent it to you personally, ma'am. Okay, okay. okay. Note this Done, children. May I proceed to next question? Please show me your thumbs up. Um, can you scroll down a little bit? Yeah, yeah. Fine, beta? Yes, ma'am. Done, children? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. 
Okay. Now may I proceed to next question? Yes, ma'am. Okay. Yes, ma'am. You can proceed. Okay. So now next question is. A number is increased by a number is increased by ten percent. Increase by ten percent and then the increased number the the video the yes then the increased number is decreased by firstly they are increasing and they are decreasing decreased by 10 percent okay then find the find the Net increase or decrease percent. So, any idea, children, how we will solve this question? Ma'am, like it, it guarantees it, like doesn't minus. No, it is mean by net increase or decrease. Firstly, it is increased by 10%, right? And then it is, it then increase number is decreased by 10%. Then find the net increase or decrease percentage. Ma'am, it is same. The increase percentage, like increase numbers, ten percent it is. Yes. So they don't be. They are not equal. Yeah, what does Ma'am, like, like uh, it can be like. Ten. What does net increase and decrease percent? It means overall. Suppose if you are having five rupees, okay, and I am giving you two rupees. Then it will be 7 rupees. And suppose if I am getting back 4 rupees from yours. Okay. So 7 minus 4 it will be 3. So I will ask you that find the total net amount which is decrease or increase. Ma'am. So initially you were having 5 rupees. Now you are having 3. It means you have decreased your amount. No, better. Yes, ma'am. Yes, beta. Ma'am, it, it, then it means question it, uh, it the number remains the same, right? First, we are increasing in the same amount, we are decreasing. Like, yes, yes, so at, yes. So, at last, nothing is increased or decreased? Uh, no. Mom, ma okay. can I tell? Yes, beta? And I think it, uh, net, net will decrease. Decrease? By how much percentage? No, I didn't calculate that. Okay. So, children, will you try or I will explain? Mom will try. We'll try. Siddhant, you are eating something. Yeah, I'm like, I came from, uh, like, I came from uh, playing, man. So, I just ate one biscuit. Okay, you are eating biscuits? Yeah, I'm only one I ate. Okay, okay, okay. It's fine. I'm like, uh, can we try and then uh, we'll do? Okay. Let's try, children. Then I will explain. I'm giving you only three minutes, three to four minutes. Okay. Mom, can you try? Yes, Ashwarya. Ashwarya, your voice is breaking, beta. I'm not able to hear you. Uh, can you once explain again net increase or decrease? See, net increase and net decrease. See, Ashwarya, suppose. Initially, you are having rupees 10, okay? Okay. And your father has given 50 rupees to you. Then total amount you are having now 60? Yes, sir. Right. Now your amount is increased by 50 rupees. Then your amount is 60. Now your brother is saying that he wants 40 rupees from you. Okay. So, you will give him 40 rupees and it will be subtracted, decrease. So, now at the last you are having 20 rupees. So, tell me, initially you were having 10 rupees. Now you are having rupees 20. 
so what is it that you have increased your amount by 10 rupees na yes ma'am but the 10% of it is yes so see 10 rupees is your net increment understood ma'am but if it's 100 then only then the 10% will be 10 rupees Or yes i am explaining just rupees. generally beta i am no. not explaining in percentage okay so if we have to find its percentage then what you will do 20 see net percentage you will find 20 minus 10 initially you are having 10 rupees into 100 so it will be 10 by 10 into 100 so there will be increment of 10% because oh sorry 100% because I'm you are having 10 rupees yes beta i'm going to explain again uh this only yes ma'am okay i was explaining about the net increment and decrement okay so see suppose you are having beta 10 rupees okay and your father has given 50 rupees to you now after increment you have got 60 rupees ma'am right so now if your brother is asking 4 rupees 40 okay so you will give him 40 rupees then you will de uh, decrease then your amount is decreased by 40 rupees beta ma'am now you are having rupees 20 in your hands right ma'am yes beta mom like by seeing your process like when i calculated i don't know is correct or not just i'm just telling i got 1% Answer is correct, beta. Um, how? Yeah, one percent is the answer. I will let you explain. So, okay. children, see here. So, twenty rupees are in your hand now. Okay. So, initially you are having ten rupees. So, it means ten plus ten, you will get twenty rupees. So, initially there is an increment of how much amount? Ten rupees. Right. Don't look okay. after this rupees fifty. Just look after ten rupees because at the last you are having only twenty rupees, right? So twenty rupees. Now you will find the net percentage. How you will find? At the end you are having twenty rupees. So twenty minus initially you are having ten rupees. So ten divided by initial amount into hundred. Then this is eight hundred percent. Okay, beta. Now come to this question. let us uh, come to this question see question is a number is increased by there are two method firstly we will solve it by variable okay so solution is Mom, like if you take the uh, variable as x, then the increase in number will be a ten uh, percent, that is zero point one zero. So it will be yes. x plus zero point one zero x. That will be one point one zero x. Yes, right? yes, yes. See, brother. So let the number be x. Now they are saying after increment of ten percent, increment of ten percent, then new number will be. Now increment is there, so increment will be in that number, na? So x plus ten percent of x. Yes. Am I correct, beta? Yes, ma'am. Okay. So now x plus ten percent means ten divided by hundred. Of means multiply. Now zero zero cancel. You will get x plus x upon ten. Now take the LCM, beta. Ten will be the LCM. So yes, when denominators are different. You will cross multiply, then it will be ten x plus x. So eleven by ten x. This is your new number after increment. Okay. So Ma now. Why are you, ma'am? Why are you multiplying it with x, ma'am? Yeah. Where? Because increment. Because the number is increased by ten percent of the original number, initial yes. amount. Yes, ma'am. Okay. So now next is. So it will be. 
you can write like this also or you can just leave the in the fraction okay so when new number is decreased by how much 10% right beta so your decreased number will be now decrease means that means you are subtracting 10% of now number is this 11x by 10 so you will write 11x by 10 minus 10% of 11x by 10 Got it, children? Yes, ma'am. Isn't yes. it like eleven x by ten minus ten percent? We are supposed to stop there, right? Yes. So now you can write eleven x upon ten minus ten percent means ten by hundred, right, beta? Into yeah. Eleven x by ten. Ten ten will cancel. Cancel. Then eleven x by ten minus eleven x by hundred. Now you can take LCM, beta. No, it will be hundred. Yes, it will be hundred. Now divide ten by hundred by ten. You will get ten. So one hundred ten x x minus eleven x. What it will be? Ninety nine. Yeah, ma'am. Zero point nine nine. Yes, ninety nine x upon hundred. And that will be zero point nine nine x. Now the yes. net charge will be x minus zero point nine nine x. Yes, yes. Now next is. Now you have got this. Now we have to find net decrease first of all, because see, here is eleven x. So net decrease will be. Initially it was x. Now you have got ninety nine x upon hundred, right, beta? So now yes, again take the LCM hundred. So hundred x minus, minus ninety nine x. So it will be one, one by hundred x. One percent. Okay. So now. We have to find percent. Net decrease percent. percent. Just wait, beta. Net decrease percent. So you will write net decrease divided by x. Original number. Okay. No, no, that is x. Yes, number into hundred. Hundred. Okay. So x by hundred divided by x. In two hundred, right, beta? So yes, you will write x upon hundred into hundred upon x. So x x cancel, hundred hundred cancel. So one percent will be the answer. Ma'am, I did not understand from a net decrease. Can you explain like, again? Net I decrease. I got the same answer, but like my process was different. Okay, just send it to me. Okay, Sidan. See, beta, you were asking me net decrease, okay? Am I audible? Yes, ma'am. Okay. Yes, ma'am. See, beta, ah, uh, after decrement of the number, you have got your final number as this ninety nine x. So it is zero point nine nine x, right, beta? Yes, ma'am. And initially we were having x. So x is greater or zero point nine nine x is greater? Ah, uh, x is greater. X is greater. It means you have decreased your amount, right? Yes, ma'am. So net decrease is there. So from the initial amount, you will decrease your new amount. So x minus ninety nine x by hundred meter. Okay. Okay. Now take the LCM. LCM of one and hundred will be. Ah, uh, hundred. Hundred. Now, okay. when denominators are different, you can just cross multiply. So, hundred into x will be hundred x, beta. Minus ninety nine into one will be ninety nine. Okay. So now subtract 
hundred minus ninety nine. It will be x by hundred, right? Yes, yes ma'am. So now net decrease percentage. Now we are having this our net decrease, and original number we are having x into hundred. Just put the values. So x by hundred divided by x into hundred. Clear? So you will write x by hundred into x into hundred. Hundred hundred cancel. X x cancel. So answer will be one. Got it? I'm can you go up so I can write the question? Yes, wait. I am scrolling up. Screen is visible, children? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Okay, please note it down at. Man, can you move up? Man. Man, can you scroll it down? Ma'am, why did you add x here like x plus 10% of x? Because we have given in the question that number is increased by 10%. What do you mean by increased? It means it should be added now 10% of x. Okay. Yeah. Fine, beta. Now I send you the answer in your, like, uh, in your personal mobile. Okay, I'm saying. Mama, is it like I should have written like a net decrease? Yes, Veda. Okay, ma'am. Mama, like I uh, just directly convert it into decimals. Yes. Because fractions It's are okay, Veda. It's okay. It's no worries, okay? Okay, thank you. Ma'am, that uh, 100x minus 99x by 100 is uh, 1 by... Uh, 1 by 100, right? X by 100. Yes, yes, yes. But when you are going to multiply 1 by X, you will get only X, beta? Yes, ma'am.
Ma'am, how 11 x minus 10 by how 11 x by 10 minus 10 by 100 is 1 1 by 10? Where? How 11 x minus 11 11 x by 10 minus 11 x by 100 is 1 1 by 10 x. 1 1 by 10 x. Yeah. Which step you are asking, Peter? Just. Uh... Um, uh, 11 x by 10 minus 11 x by 100. How is it equal to uh, 1 100? Okay, okay, okay. See, Peter. After taking the LCM, LCM of 10 and 100 is 100, Peter? Yes, ma'am. See, uh, 100, okay. So, when you are going to divide 100 by 10, what you will get? 10 only? Yes, now, you will multiply 11x by 10, right? Now, 100 divided by 100, it would be 1. So, 1 into 11x. Yes, Got it? Man, can you scroll down? Yeah, but... Done. Done, children? Mom, one minute. Oh, ma'am. Yes, okay. So all have understood uh, this question, beta? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yes. Ma'am, like, why did you do net decrease? Percentage equals to net decrease into 100 by number. Okay. Uh, Ashwath, tell me if I'm asking you that find the percentage of your marks. So how you are going to find the percentage? Suppose you have got... 400 marks out of 500, right? So, okay. 500 is a total marks, Vita? And you are going to yes. multiply it by 100. So, it will be 80%. Right? So, in the same way, net decrease, we are having x, y, 100. And initially, total was we are having x. So, that's why I have divided by this. Okay? Ma'am, like, how did you got uh, 80%? See, 400 divided by 500 multiply by 100. Double zero, double zero, cancel. Five ones are five. Five eights are 40 and zero, so 80%. Okay. Okay. Okay, ma'am. Ma uh, yeah. How to do from x, x divided by 100 by x is equal to 100? x into 100. How to do that? Can you explain again? See this. See, beta. Rohini? Yes, uh, ma'am. See. x by 100 divided by x is there? Yes, ma'am. Into 100. So, you will shift this 100 to this along with x. So, x by 100 into x is there. Okay? Multiply How by 100. How thing that? Like, you can't... See, see, see. See, beta. Suppose you are having A by B divided by C. Okay, ma'am. Okay. This is our rule. Those who have copied can leave. Yes, beta. So you will write B along with C in the Bye, denominator. A by beta. A Bye. divided by B into C. Bye, Bye, Bye ma'am. Thank you, ma This is the rule, beta. Okay, Rohini. Okay, ma'am. So if you are having A divided by B divided by C, so you will write A divided by B into C and D will goes in numerator. Okay? So, like when three numbers are dividing, we need to multiply the last two numbers? Yes, we will divide, we will multiply the denominators. Okay? Okay, ma'am. Yeah. Divesh, have you understood, beta? Advik, Advika? Yes, Rohini, Hamza, Charvik? Yes, ma'am. I'm done writing. Okay.
Hamza, have you understood, beta? Ma'am, sir, can I leave? I wrote the question answer. Okay, you can leave, beta. Thank you, okay. ma'am. Ma Thank you, ma'am. Bye, ma'am. Bye, 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 beta. Thank you, ma'am. Hi, beta. Sharvik written, beta? Sharvik, am I audible? Bye-bye, Sharvik. 